The McCurry County deputy who was shot in July while he was on duty is walking again. Deputy Tyler Watkins says he's still got a ways to go in his recovery, but as LEX 18's Catherine Collins found out, he's already being recognized for his bravery. The steps don't come easy. I still have bad days, but I have a lot of good days too because I'm thankful, you know, the good Lord let me stay on this earth. Deputy Tyler Watkins is back on his feet with his girlfriend Kayla Petrie by his side. Oh, you never think it's going to hit home. It's always going to be, I mean, I never thought it'd be anybody in law enforcement that I knew. She says life has been busy, exhausting even, since Watkins was hurt on the job. The new deputy was responding to a call for a welfare check when he was shot, once in his protective vest and again in his lower abdomen. Everybody's called me a hero. Personally, I don't feel like a hero. To me, I was just doing my job. But Watkins now has a symbol of the actions he took that day. On Thursday, he was awarded the Medal of Honor by the Kentucky Sheriff's Association, credited with saving lives by returning fire towards the person who shot him. You've got to risk your life every day. That's why we wear those vests. But knowing that I did protect those people, um, does make me feel a lot better. Watkins plans to return to his job as a deputy as soon as he can. That's his job. That's what he wants to go for. Petrie says she'll be by his side then too. In McCreary County, Catherine Collins, LEX 18 News. And 48-year-old Mark Dungan has been charged in connection to the shooting that injured Deputy Watkins.